Hello my friends, I'm here with Tristan today and aggressive hydraulics. I say it like that, but you guys know I'm passive. I'm a hugger, I'm not as aggressive as I used to be, but sometimes in machining, we have to be aggressive. Today we're gonna talk a bit about Gibbs Cam, but before we do, we wanna build that solid foundation so you know how important this conversation is for you guys to pay attention to and learn from. So Tristan, yep. firstly, you've been doing this for about 30 years, haven't you? That's correct, 30 years this year. 30 years, incredible. I, I love when I get to hear these types of stories. And let's talk about aggressive hydraulics when yeah. we talk about how far your span is around the world and some of the parts you make. Yeah, the Uniques, we are specialized in hydraulic cylinders, custom hydraulics. We are on all seven continents, and there's really nothing made in this world without hydraulics. Roads, everything you drive on, all different multifaceted businesses, um, pretty unique. Before we dive into the Gibbs Cam side of things, because you know I'm going to ask you why Gibbs Cam. That's the next yep. question coming. Right before, I just heard you say all seven continents, did I not? That is correct. Can I, on camera, now that we've hit record, ask you if we can go to Antarctica together? Yes. We can? We can. I got it on camera, my friends. Now let's slide into Gibbs Cam. <laughs> all right, buddy, you're on seven continents. You've been doing this for 30 years. You've seen a lot. Hydraulics are everywhere. You've already mentioned it. Yep. Why Gibbs Cam? Gibbs Cam gives us that standardization feature. You know, 30 years ago, we had 25 different guys doing things 25 different ways. <laughs> However, with Gibbs Cam, it gives you a more efficient tool path, different efficiencies, allows the operators to optimize each piece of equipment, but it gives you that one standard tool path that everyone can use, and that's what we like about it, standardization. And the end result is always the same product, but it gives you that standard feature, and that's where we were looking to go. Yeah, I've been in machine shops, very similar to how you just described, and you might even have the same part running on three different machines, and the cycle times are completely different. The tool life is completely Correct. different. They even pop off with different tolerances because everyone did it their own way, exactly. probably programming from the machine itself, right? Yeah, yeah the longhand programming, but with Gibbs Cam, you take the fat fingering out of it, if you will. You know what I mean? The people that actually let me fat finger the wrong number, you get a plus instead of a negative, a five instead of a two, things like that. You take that out of it, and then Gibbs Cam gives you a more efficient tool path, and it doesn't make those human mistakes. Yeah, if we we're talking about fat fingers, do you remember the cell phones that would flip open? You had to hit a number three times <laughs> three in times order to get, you get the, the right letter. letter. I was fat fingering all the time. That's for a different story on another day. Exactly. Let's talk about the offline programming, the ability to keep the machines running. I heard a rumor one time that 40% is average or even good average uptime in a machine shop for a spindle to be running. And yes. that to me seems a little bit low. When you can program offline and keep the machine spindles running, that's kind of a bonus as well, isn't it? Yes, it's all about uptime, and that's where Gibbs Cam also comes in and allows us to program ahead of time. So when the guys get the parts, they get the job, the program's already done. The machine is more uptime is what you will, versus the downtime of them having, when, the, when they got a program at the control, they have to do it while the machine is down. Obviously it's not running, not making products, things like that. Very few people will do it in background edit. That's just dangerous, in, in my opinion, over my course of my career. But Gibbs Cam allows you that efficient tool path to do it offline, and they get the code, they're ready to roll. I concur with your opinion, totally yeah. agree. Now I have to ask you a question as well because when it comes to service and support, I would say that's discussionably the most important thing that anyone can offer, especially if something being new to someone. You've worked in this industry a while, I've worked in this industry a yep. while. We're quite traditional. Yep. We like that comfort zone. Correct. They say that nothing grows in the comfort <laughs> zone, but we sure do like it there. If somebody's coming in to Gibbs Cam for the first time, you're bringing in someone new to this company who's working in seven continents, as yep. you've said. How familiar can they get with this software and how quickly do you think they can understand it? Uh, it I think it all depends on the person, obviously, but I think uh, they could really familiarize themselves quickly. I think they could turn around. We've been training guys in, in one week. One week's time, plus the classes that Midwest Camp Solution has to offer as far as Gib Camps, phenomenal. One week seems really quick. It is quick. That's, that's basic. It's yeah, basic. that's super I mean, impressive though. But on top of that, let's pretend that I'm a dummy. You guys know that sometimes I am. That I'm a dummy and I have so many questions and you guys probably have questions for the Midwest Cam Solution guys as well. How is the service and support when there is an issue? The service is great. You send an email. I'd use a lot of times a pack and go feature. The guys answer the phone. That's part of the, ha that's half the battle with anyone is just <laughs> picking up the phone nowadays. A lot of people text or email, but their responsiveness is phenomenal. Even that guy, Andy? Does he even answer Andy. the phone? Andy, Andy answers Andy. the phone. Andy answers well, the phone. You know it's a good company when Andy is answering the phone as well. Tristan, thank you so much for joining yeah, me on appreciate camera. It. I will see you in Antarctica, I hope. You've already got it on camera. We're on it. We're going to film in Antarctica, folks, but this is a bit of Midwest Cam Solutions, Gibbs Cam, and aggressive hydro. Oh, I almost hurt my back with that one. All right, thanks, guys, for watching. I'll see you later.